Why, hello, you amazing, beautiful people. Welcome back to another anime reaction video. So, a few days ago, a few days ago, I reacted to uh, Kuma's list where they party ranked with a bunch of other people. Nicholas Light's anime openings. 50 of them, I might add. That was a five, but imagine there was a zero after it. And now, our boy, old Nicky Light, has put together a... I'm gonna read it out as he wrote it. My top 60 anime openings of all time. 60 is a random number, Nicholas Light, but uh, you know what? I'm here for it. Now, for starters, dude is brave. He is brave. He is brave doing this. This is brave. Because in the anime community, putting together any list where you rank anything is like... Is, you know, it's like trying to make world peace. It's, it's, it's pretty difficult. So shout out to that guy for being brave enough to do this. And I am curious to see this freaking list. He has asked a bunch of reactors to react to it. He said, check it out, react to it. So I was going to and he dropped the video. Before I even jump into it, I just want to say, please go check out the original freaking video. A link to it is in the description. Shout out to Nicholas Light. Go subscribe to him. And if you're not subscribed to him and you haven't liked or watched his video, you shouldn't even be watching this reaction. Go watch it first. All right, link in the description. But for now, I'm going to stop talking. Like the video. Subscribe to this channel as well. Maybe one day we can get a gold plaque like Nicholas Light is going to get in. What, like, I don't know. Two days, he's close. He's close, nearly on 940,000. The dude is gonna get it any day now. So, let's see what his top 60 anime openings are. Let's go. Wait, did he say how it was ranked? It's ranked least to most favorite. All right, the fact that he's done this. So, so number one is his all time favorite anime opening. It's gonna be interesting. Did he edit this? This must've been the first thing, right? I am noticing that he is, I am noticing he is a, oh my word, the irregular magic high school? Oh no, this is the old one. I am, I am noticing he is a, he has a massive soft spot for my first story, by the way. So far, two bangers here, which I love because my first story was. My first story in Lisa. I find this opening so weird, man. So weird. It's good, but it's so weird. Yeah, 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 that's a banging opening. That is a banging opening. This next opening always reminds me, I could die in your arms tonight. I don't know why, but Wolf Rain's opening always makes me think of that song. Yeah, yeah, man. yeah, man. This, this is banging. I don't know why, but always, always makes me think of that song. It is a great opening. Anything by Yammer is banging. I'm impressed with this list, by the way. Ah, oh, my dude! My gosh! Let's all be honest for a second here. Let's all be honest. Let's all be honest. Let's all be honest. Let's all be honest. That is a banging song. That is a banging song. And you know what? Cold Rain. Cold Rain deserves so much more love. So much more freaking love, man. One of my favorite freaking bands out of the anime world. Love them. Awesome. They're amazing. I always, I know, I, so this was on the other list. I love this opening. You know what? You know what, actually, I was about to say I love this opening, but it's not my favorite from Overlord. But you know what? I'm never going to say anything like that because I'd say trying to pick your favorite opening from Overlord is like trying to pick your favorite opening from Vinland Saga. It's pretty fucking difficult when they're all amazing. So you know what? Any opening from Overlord, any opening from Vinland Saga, is incredible. I say this, I think Overlord and Vinland Saga have some of the strongest, consistent 10 out of 10 anime openings in anime. What would you guys say is another anime that just has like perfect 10 out of 10 openings, like the whole way through? Not one bad one, all right? If, it's, if there's even one bad one, and by bad, I mean one that isn't 10 out of 10. So even a nine out of 10 is considered bad. Then I don't want you to be putting it in that comment section. All right, all right, all right. Am I gonna get to do the dance? Come on, bro. Don't don't you do this. Don't blue ball me. Nah. That 
was terrified there for a little bit that he was about to you know just just blue ball me but I know for a fact Nicholas Light would never do that to me moving on <laughs> another really weird wacky but brilliant opening you see what I mean <laughs> Literally reminds me of Amp 3D. Any of you ever play Amp 3D, like the, the snowboarding game? All the cutscenes look like that. What's this? The ah, oh. I think I personally prefer Link Click's opening too. I think that one is bang. Hunter Hunter is just a masterpiece. It's a masterpiece. It is a masterpiece of a freaking anime, man. It's so good. So good. I shouldn't be saying masterpiece because I reserve masterpiece until I finish an anime. But I'm going to tell you right now. Or it has to be a complete anime. So that I don't like using that word, so I take it back. But it is as close to a masterpiece as I can rank it before I've actually finished it. I will say this right now. Anyone who's watching this, if you haven't seen Hunter x Hunter, believe me when I tell you, you are missing out so much. It's awesome. It's awesome. It's so good. Man, Nicholas Light's got pretty awesome taste in music. Let's be real. The guy has such incredible variation. This is insane. There's no consistency to this. He's all over the place. It's like 50 different people put their favorite openings in this. Never in my life. Did I think that Nicholas Light would have a K-pop group in his top 60 anime openings? TXT? TXT? Tomorrow XT ever? TXT? One of my all-time favorite freaking K-pop groups. Their song Frost is amazing. If you haven't heard it, you check it out right now. It's awesome. Nicholas Light put a K-pop group in it. As a huge K-pop fan, you all know how much I love K-pop. I am a huge K-pop fan. I react to pretty much everything K-pop related. We interview K-pop artists, huge K-pop fan. I am surprised and super proud of our boy on this one. My man. I like Spire stuff. 10 out of 10 opening. Abnormalized, man. Anything from TK is just 10 out of 10. This is a banging. It's hard to say this isn't my favorite One Piece opening, man. This opening is so good. So good. Is. Bish. Bish. Alright, Bish is banging. I'm gonna say Heavenly Delusion is another anime I feel like everyone needs to watch at least once. You may be like me, where you come out of it and you're like, what did I just watch? But it is very good. But more than that, the reason I recommend it is because it's very unique. And I feel like uniqueness is something I lean towards more than anything else. If an anime or a show or anything is unique, you have my attention. So my first story again. You love to see it. <laughs> oh my god, yes! Yes! Yes, the cool of that opening is a banger. Banging opening. Yeah, 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 yeah. So good. So good. So good. I'm telling you right now, all right? The fact that that's 39, I'm a little bit angry about. But the fact that it's on your list, I'm happy about. In the last, the Kuma one, which was the unofficial list, I noticed that that wasn't on there, but the original Formula Alchemist opening was. Not for any show in that opening, I think that opening is amazing, but personally, for me, my personal taste in music, I think the Brotherhood opening is, is, is better. That's just me saying it. And I think the Brotherhood opening is one of my favorite anime openings of all time. Also, I've heard, I'm not 100% sure about this, um, but I've heard Nicholas Light ranked his openings list the same way I did mine, but I didn't put mine in order. I just gave mine to Kuma. 
Um, and that was, I did it solely based on the song. Literally what I would add to my playlist. I ignored the anime even existed. Just the fucking song. I think that is the safest way to put together an openings list. Otherwise you get recency biased, you get freaking uh, popularity bias and all this shit, which is why I was like, I'm not gonna do any of that. I'm doing it on the song only, just the song. And that was it. And I've heard Nicholas Light did the same way. And if he did, massive respect. Cause honestly, I think that is one of the best ways to do this. Great opening, great opening, great opening, great opening. Really like this song. Man, I'm sure can say. I so want to watch Ginsu. Wow, we skipped past that one quick. Anything by Evie's great. I want to watch My Hero Academia as well. I'm jumping through them quickly now. Another anime I want to watch. We've had three anime in a row I really want to watch. What is this? Oh, I remember this. I remember this. Here we go. Yes, 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 yes! My guy! Yes. One of my favorite freaking openings ever. The second I heard this song once. The second the second I heard that song once, I immediately added it to my playlist. That song is freaking awesome. Again, really unique, really unusual, really well put together, and just a fantastic song. Great song. Great, great, great song. Great song. I'm interested to see what his top 10 are. That's what I'm most excited about, his top 10. Again. Hajime no Ippo. I think I remember this. Is this a good anime? Would I like it? You gotta commend Nicholas Life for having such a crazy variation in his openings. I cannot wait to see what this dude's number one is. Another My First Story. Could it be possible that he is a huge fan of My First Story? Nah, that would be crazy. <laughs> My first story deserves so much more love, and I'm so glad Nicholas Light has given them that love because they just, they just bloody well do. They are such a freaking awesome band. I love that. I absolutely freaking love that. That is awesome, man. That is awesome. awesome. Very good Jujutsu Kaisen opening. An interesting one to pick. Kenji Yonezu, my guy! Yes! Yes! Fuck yes, this opening is banging! Banging opening! Yes, 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 yes! Yes! I'm gonna say this right now, huge shout out to Nicholas Light because this list is so diverse. It's got a little bit of something for everybody in it. It really bloody well does as well. This is such a diverse, well put together list. I just wanna say, you have done an excellent job putting this together. Well done, well done, seriously, well done. I feel like that it feels really well varied. It's got like a really good variety. It's it's really good and I'm, I'm super impressed with you, dude. You've done an excellent job, well done. Well done. Banging list. You know what? So good. So good. You know what? I'm gonna say this right now. If someone puts a recent anime opening in their list and you are one of these people who then comments on their list and you go, oh, recency bias. Go away. All right? What are you on about? If, if the anime opening has just come out and it's good and someone puts it on their list, 
what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you actually mean? What do you mean? I, someone said this about my list because we went over it on stream. And I literally said, I, I went through my list. I was like, what are you want about? <laughs> that is so just wrong. You can't say that. I was like, these, there's a reason these songs are on there because they're good. That makes no sense. Is there a rule? If I'm putting together an anime openings list, you, you have, you can't, anything that came out in the last six years, you're not allowed to use. No, shush. All right, I won't hear nothing. I won't hear nothing. Anyone moaning about the Shangri-La Frontier one on there or anything like, oh, recency, you're shush. That song is fucking amazing. That's why it's on there. Banging song. I mean, it would be criminal to not have a domestic girlfriend on your list. 22 is great, but you have to have this on your list. Do you even list, bro, if you don't have it on your list? Two Kenshi Yonezu songs? I'm, I'm here for the guy is incredible. Man, I can't wait for the movie to come back. 20! Twenty. Twenty. Whoa. I'm. Do you know what? I'm. I'm starting to wonder if people don't like the Tokyo Ghoul opening because I'm not. Most people. When I see people ranking it, they have it really low down. I guess the fact it's on his list in general means people like it. But for me, it's one of the. This is my personal opinion and taste in music. But I'm a huge TK fanboy. I love all of TK stuff. I think it's all excellent. A Tokyo Ghoul's opening Unravel would be like in my top five. I think it's awesome. But everyone I know I've spoken to doesn't really have it that high up. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. Is it just me? Am I on my own waving the flag of the Unravel opening? Am I? Maybe. I know it's a lot of people lean towards this opening over the Cold Rain one. But for me, the Cold Rain one will always be my favorite. But I do appreciate Inferno a lot. It is fantastic. Another spy, yeah. Love to see it. This is our first Uber one. My first bleach is amazing. I'm looking forward to watching this one. Man, I want to watch every anime on this side of the I spoke about this in my uh, video, my one of my more recent videos, coming remember which one, and I literally said, huge respect to Nicholas Light for putting an 86 opening in there, but not because of the opening, but because of the anime. Um, 86, in my opinion, is one of the most underappreciated and awesome anime out there. And if you haven't seen it, you are missing out. It's so, it's so good. It's so good. I love that anime so much. I, if I put together a top five list, it would probably be in there. It's so good. Oh, it's so good. But I couldn't personally put it on my list because I I didn't I think the openings are good, but I think the endings are just way better. I think the endings are fucking awesome. And personally for me, if I put together an endings list, I think all the 86 endings would be on there. Um I, I am tempted to do an endings list, but no one really cares about endings. But you know, that's why. So that for me that's why but yeah, I think 86 is just it's just such an underappreciated anime. Man. Great opening, by the way. Great opening. Everything Born You Do is incredible. That most recent Spy Family song was amazing. But again, that's an ending. Oh man, maybe you could do an ending. You know, I completely forgot about this song. Completely forgot about this song when I put together my one. It's, it's such a good song. It is a great song. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Banging fucking opening, man. Banging opening. Banging opening paradox. Banging opening paradox, man. Oh. We're jumping into the top 10. We're jumping into the top 10. 
banana fish, yes. All right, yep, 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 yep. Approved. Bang and opening. Survives at the profit, awesome, man. Bang and opening. Yeah, 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 my guy, yep. Hell yeah. Such a good opening. All right, opening one, all right. I can appreciate this too. This is a very, very good opening. Again, anything by Eevee is always amazing. Shout out. Little bit of a, uh, a little bit of a soft spot for that song, but for reasons that only like none of you are gonna know. <laughs> oh man, I knocked my mic down. Attacking my mic. Still working? Yeah. Again, again. I, I, I don't think, I don't think the, um, the Cold Rain one is even on this list. But yeah, it's, it's, I, again, I love Aima. I think Aima's amazing. But yeah, strange. Wide man, Dif again, different taste. Everyone has a different taste. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Flow again. We're in the top five now. Hide, just a legend in Japan. We're in the top five now. We're in the end game now. You ready? Five, Attack on Titan, Red Swan. Okay. Black Clover. It's funny, I like Black Catcher, but it's definitely not my favorite Black Clover opening, but everyone seems to love that one a lot. White Noise? This is such an interesting top five! Jeez! Can I guess his number one? And we knew the Code Gas ones would be this high. What would be his number one? What would be his number one? I feel like, if I'm putting myself in the mind of Nicholas Light, I'm not going to have a rock song. Nicholas Light is too anime for that. He's gonna have an anime song. He's gonna have a, an anime song. For me, I maybe like some Demon Slayer ones, but I don't think so. I reckon it's gonna be like, not heavy, not like a rock one. It won't be like Cold Rain, Sim, Survives of the Prophet. It won't be those. It will be like something along the lines of something a bit more old school. Something like Flow. You know, something like that. That's my guess. That's put myself in the mind, Nicholas. Like, but I. But I'm saying number two. Ah! Has to be. Uh, that has to be. Has to be this high. Has to be. Bang it. That's number one. I was wrong. I was literally wrong. I was so wrong. So wrong. So wrong. I literally said it's not gonna be survive said the prophet. My dumbass knows nothing. Knows nothing. I was literally like, it ain't gonna be survive said the prophet. I'm surprised River isn't on here. Jesus. I was literally like, nah, it ain't gonna be survive said the prophet. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I uh, the thing is, I literally thought like, okay, I know Nicholas Light's favorite stuff is like is like Cold Rain, is my first story, is Survive Said the Prophet, is Sim. I was like, I know he loves that metal. I know he loves that rock. He's like, same shit I love, right? I know he loves that. So I was like, but, you know, this guy is like, he's the, he's the anime dude. He's in the anime community, you know it. So I was like, he's gonna have some fancy anime opening. You know, it'll be, it'll be a fancy anime number one. That's what I was thinking. No, bro just literally went for the shit we know he loves. Bro just went straight out for the Vinland Saga opening. Didn't piss about nothing. Literally went straight for it. Straight for it. You know what? Let's play it. Let's let it run. Mad respect for this being his number one. Because this means this list is genuine. This is his damn list. This is his this is fucking this is a genuine list. This is number one. This is a uh, this is a stamp I'm of sure approval. There's going to be no negative comments. That people <laughs> All right, let's watch this dude roll this out. But before we do that, I just want to say your list is, is fucking awesome. Hey, this song for me as number one is the certified stamp of approval. That is why I think I, I think having this as number one just means this is his list.
This is his genuine list. It is 100% genuine. It is him based on the music he loves, based on the songs he loves. It is his list. You can tell. Having this as number one, that, that, for me, that certifies this list as an absolute fucking incredible, well put together. I'm sure there's going to be no negative comments and people wondering, where's this one? Where's Oshinoko? Honestly, these are the 60 songs that I listen to. I want you guys down below to let me know. What are your top 10 anime openings of all time? Maybe I'll do a video looking at those comments. Who knows? This took a lot of time to do. I'm not gonna lie, like- how, Look at the size of this dude. How, how much time is he spending in the gym? Bro looks like he could turn around and just walk through that wall behind him. Fuck me, Nicholas, like, Jesus Christ. Jesus, calm down. You're starting to look like that, whatever that, is that a Titan on your shelf in the back? That's literally you. That's you. That's you when you don't do your hair. You're looking like that dude. Jesus, man. Jesus, look at this guy. Of all time. Buff. Maybe I'll do a video looking at those comments. Who knows? This took a lot of time to do. I'm not gonna lie. Like, ranking these 60 to 1 was really hard. Just even coming up with 60 was hard. So whether my list is an L or a W, it doesn't fucking matter because it's my list. It's my taste. And my taste, my list is gonna be different from yours. I can still call your list shit, so I don't blame the people that call my list shit if they do. And yeah, man, that's, that's gonna be it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I've never done anything like this. Also, get me to uh, 1 million subscribers. We're almost there. Sayonara. Go subscribe. Go subscribe. Go subscribe right now. Go subscribe right now. Go subscribe right now. You go subscribe. All right. You go subscribe. You go subscribe to Nicholas Light. You do it. Link in the description. Go subscribe. Go subscribe. Right. Did I miss anything? It's a shout out to his, well, his Patreons, I'm guessing. Go subscribe. All right. Link to his video is in the description. I want to say a couple of things before I run out this video. First thing I want to say. The amount of people that say they're surprised Idol isn't on people's lists. Put it this way. Now, this is how I explain it because I explained it in my list because it's not on my list either And the reason is one not my favorite Yoasogi song Two I feel like if you see Idol as number one on someone's list it is not For the reasons you think it is so Personally Idol not one of my favorite songs in the anime world Idol is literally because he mentioned Oshinoko Idol is literally uh, in my opinion, arguably one of the biggest, if not the biggest, anime song ever. And what I mean by that is how much attention it brought to the anime, how much attention the song got, how many covers it got, how it just traveled everywhere, how it charted. It was just this huge song. It just everywhere, right? But that for me means that in terms of an anime openings list, if you're ranking the popularity of the opening, if you're ranking the influence of the opening, if you're ranking how well the opening fits to the anime and you're taking it in the anime as well, and all of that into consideration, then if you write a list based on all of that, Oshinoko's Idol has to be in the top five, top three, or even number one. It has to be. But if you're writing a list simply based on your music taste, it don't need to be anywhere in it, all right? Unless you literally listen to that song and love it, which is a great song, so I can see why a lot of people would, but it doesn't need to be on your list. So that's why. So I feel like if you see a lot of lists where that may not be on it, that's just because it's not someone's song taste. It has nothing to do with the size or popularity of the opening or the popularity of the anime itself. And I feel like that's where you can distinguish the two different kinds of lists you're, you're watching. I think that's why. Um, because I had a lot of people saying they were surprised it wasn't on mine, and I did have a Yoasobi song, my favorite Yoasobi anime song on my list, and that is an idol. So yeah, also huge shout out to Nicholas Light for taking out the time to actually put together this list, putting the work in and making it because it is a banging freaking list. It's very, very good. Every single opening on this list deserves the recognition and love it gets. Is They're all freaking awesome. So huge shout out, well done. You put together an awesome list. You should be proud. You're taking the time to do this. I imagine most people are gonna really appreciate it. And it was a very, very good list. There's always gonna be a few people who don't, but keep in mind what Nicholas Light said there at the end, everybody's tastes are different. Everybody has different opinions. Everyone likes different things. My favorite food ain't your favorite food, all right? My favorite food, chili. I love chili. I love chili and nachos. My favorite food, number one, it's awesome. Not your favorite food, right? Does that mean your opinion is wrong and my opinion is right or the other way around? No, it doesn't mean nothing. It just means you have different tastes. And it's the same with my favorite movie, my favorite TV show, my favorite color. Although if, you, if you're an adult and you have a favorite color, it's... it's well, I mean, I do have a favorite color. So if you're not have a favorite color, then you're cool. Anyway, you know what I mean? Everyone has different tastes. Everyone has different things they love. Your favorite anime is going to be different to most people you're talking to. So chill. All right, let everyone have their different tastes because otherwise you aren't allowed yours. All right, treat people how you want to be treated and be nice and be respectful. And no arguments in those comment sections down below. Be nice. And also, if you're not subscribed to Nicholas Light, go give him a sub. Go help this dude get to a million. He deserves it. He's awesome.
Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Let me know what you thought about his list as well. Be nice. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Make sure you go check out this dude, Nicholas Light. You put together a banging list. You really, really did. You should be proud, dude. I love this list. It was awesome. I approve of everything on it. It was amazing. Not that my approval means anything. I'm an anime baby, but I liked it. <laughs> anyway, I had a lot of fun reacting to this. I'm looking forward to seeing who else reacts to this. And yeah, also go check out Kuma. They're awesome. Have an awesome day, everybody. And as always, you will see me in the next video.